So we'll start our official game, our first semi-final for the wild card for the International 2015. Welcome to the International Five. They get another kill. Buy back. Will buy back. GG. 55-55. That's going to be the victory going the way of Scenic in our first game in this best of three. They do not lose a single person in this push. They're so dominant. Where is it? They turn. They have the high ground. Ember Baron. No, my bad. And C Deck will advance through to the winner's bracket final. KP will follow as well. They've lost three already. Double buyback. Make it four. The clockwork down. C Deck just crushing through MVP. Just looking solid in this game number two. They will be in the main event. C Deck crushing through as C Deck make their stand. And they move in onto the Shiki, looking for a stun. Oh, and they will find the queen again. And C deck emerge victors in a thriller. They'll take the 1 0 advantage to get this BO2 kicked off. This team just continues to deliver. Yes, it is Q with the C-Deck is going to cause a lot of problems. This has to be one of the biggest surprise stories of the International out of any of them that I've ever cast. A triple kill actually for Aggressive Ball. MM1 out of the T1 Tower trying to fight up against Aggressive. It's going to be an ultra kill. There's no real way to escape. GG, newbie, never had a chance. XZ, two melee racks. C-Deck just made the TI4 champions look like noobs. Niki just rips him a new one. C-Deck are finding the opening. I don't know how, but they keep on doing it. C-Deck again and again with the upset. C-Deck take four wins in a row. They are truly the Cinderella story of TI5. Just watching how they play and how, like, how they win these games, they are so polished, well above any of these other teams. Just two more. C deck rampaging through the cloud nine side of the map. As C deck are the ones to group, they're the team that wants to fight 5v5. Cloud nine get absolutely slaughtered, and they're looking for more misery next. It's GG. C deck have done the unthinkable. This team goes from wild card contender to guaranteed top six and guaranteed well over a million dollars at the International 2015. Wiping LGD and only costing a silencer to do it. Cedek, what a storm, what a play, what a team. GG, LGD, not only did they lose, they lost to an overly impressive Cedek. A flawless performance by the team that has come the hardest road to get through the winner's bracket. Therefore, laid down that five PPD. Aoi with the charge of Shiki. Shiki gets the Laguna off onto some mail. Now CDC off the back. Aoi trying to find the bashes. He'll get it. The ice shards come out. Aoi's going to go for it. Let's see with the TB up. He wants to join the fight. Moving in onto Fear. The Shuriken as well. Fear is still alive. He will. This is the illusion. Yeah, the Valentin gets him in the end. Now the Yule's holding some mail in place. They're going to look for a fourth here. He will be able to get his blink out, but now it's out. Down. The universe is going to look to surge himself away, but aggressive and Q to acing him down with the diffusal blade. Sonic Wave comes out, but it doesn't matter. Universe to fall. PPD just having to get himself out of there with some mail. Is that it? That's it! 20 minutes in, CDE, see them! They're into the grand finals! They've 